monumental things are taking place in Newport News. History is being made in Newport News today. An exciting new initiative, life-changing projects, incredible accomplishments. It really is an exciting time. Good morning, everyone. So it is extremely exciting right now to be in Newport News, and especially in this neighborhood. Uh, for those of you who don't know, I'm McKinley Price, Mayor of the City of Newport News, and it is great to be here in this neighborhood, my neighborhood. I always enjoy attending ribbon cuttings because that signifies that there's growth in our city. And I was born and raised here in the southeast, and this area, as I remember it and knew it as I grew up, was bustling with businesses and movie theaters and jewelry stores and, and everything. And it is great to now see a pharmacist here in need. And as we talked earlier, it's been three years since we've had one in this area, and this is a welcome treasure to our neighborhood. Thanks to a $30 million grant from the Department of Housing and Urban Debe Development, as well as significant investments from the federal and state government, the city, and strategic partners, this area is being given new life. Some of you may recall, um, just about a year ago, we were across the street um, doing the ribbon cutting for the offices at 25 and J. Our mayor spoke about transformation, and it's wonderful to see the transformation of the community, the growth as you drive down Jefferson Avenue. So we thank you and welcome you and appreciate what you're doing in our city. The response from the people has been overwhelming. They seem pleased to find a locally owned pharmacy in their community, and they appreciate the care, concern, and convenience that we offer. And I would like to also thank everyone for coming out this morning to help me celebrate the opening of a new pharmacy in Southeast Newport News. All right. So, you know, it's like I was looking around, I wasn't ready to stop working. I thought that I still had some good years left in me, and I was looking around where would be a good place to have a retail pharmacy because that's what I do. And I looked in the Denby area. Um, they got plenty of pharmacies up and down Wart Boulevard. I uh, looked in the Hampton uh, and Newport News area. They have plenty of pharmacies um, up and down Mercury Boulevard. And where I looked where they didn't have a pharmacy was the Southeast community. This area lost their only pharmacy uh, in February of eight, uh, 19. So it was three years that they didn't have a pharmacy very close to where they live. Many of the people that live in this area, uh, I know, walk and ride bicycles and ride the bus, and that's very difficult to get to the pharmacy over three miles away. So when I was looking to see where there was a need, the Southeast uh, community is the one that I chose. Most of the larger pharmacies are about 15,000 square feet uh, for the whole store. Um, this pharmacy is about 1,500 square feet. But if you look at the larger stores, their pharmacy section is about 12 or 1,500 square feet. So I have been practicing pharmacy for over 42 years now, and uh, I can do anything that you need. Any vaccine I can do, I have several uh, on hand. If I don't have it, I could order it for you anything as far as prescriptions is concerned. I appreciate all the support that people have given me so far in my first six months. Um, so happy to be here. Everybody that comes in is very, very supportive. They're happy that I'm here. <laughs> Thank you for watching Newport News TV. 